Video number two for cheat code 5.3i. We're talking about the uh, multiplication of a whole number and a fraction using pictorial models. Okay, so what's going on here? Oh, I think I went one too far. There we go. Weather delayed four sixths of 24 flights. Okay. This is cool. Four sixths of 24 flights departing from an airport. All of the departing flights are listed in the chart. How many flights departing from the airport were delayed? Whoa, okay. So let's look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six. And this is one, two, three, four. Four times six is 24, we knew that. Four out of six were delayed. Well, let's look at this. We could say four out of six were delayed. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four out of the six groups, and we can divide it horizontally. Well, let's see, four times four is 16. How many flights were delayed? 16. Four out of six. The cool thing about these pictures is it, they help you draw. You can just draw all over them. Divide six, you know, one, two, three, four, four out of six. So, there you go. All right. Which model represents three fifths of 15? Okay. Three fifths out of 15. Whoa. So what are we going to do here? How many three fifths times one 15 over one? 45 over five. five div 45 divided by nine, that's nine. Nine's our answer. Watch this. One, two, three, four, five. Three out of five. Okay. What's three fifths of 15? How many are there total? Uh, look, three, six, nine, 12, 15. Does that make sense? So if we have 15 and we want to make it three fifths of 15, this is a multiplication problem. See what I did? You can multiply a fraction times a whole number by just turning the whole number into a fraction. Put it over one. Three times 15 is 45. Five times one is five. What is 45 divided by not by five? It's nine. Whoa. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine shaded out of 15. That's our answer. These picture graphs, sometimes they're confusing, but they do make sense at the end. They do make sense. You can defend it with numbers. Some people can see it visually, but count, right? This, this picture graph right here has all the numbers we need. It has 15, because there's 15 individual things. It's got five groups, perfect, and it's got three shaded, three-fifths. Out of 15, it's got all three numbers that we need to be correct. Okay. Number five. Tamika made six gallons of lemonade. Oh. Tamika made six gallons of lemonade. She used three quarters of a cup for each gallon of lemonade as shown. Which model represents the amount of sugar equivalent to the amount Tamika used? Whoa, okay, so let's do this. Six times three quarters. So three quarters times six over one equals 18 over four. What's 18 divided by four? Four times four is 16. So four remainder of two, right? And I'll, I'll, I'll draw that out here. 18 divided by four, four times four is 16 minus two, remainder two, four remainder two. So we have four remainder two 
and we keep our denominator. So what is four and two quarters equals four and one half. Four and a half is our answer. So what's our, uh, here it is. And it might be hard to see with the shading. One, two, three, four, and one half. Okay. A is our answer. Think about it. She used three quarters of a cup. She did not use one cup per gallon, and she made six gallons total. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Wrong. Wrong. She used less than a cup per gallon, so it cannot be six. It's got to be less than six. Okay. It's definitely not more than six. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you are enjoying these videos. If you need a follow-up or if you have a follow-up question, call me. We can work together. I can make another video. You know, whatever you want. I'm here to help. Thanks.